Hello and welcome. It's Situation Saturday. I'm Maureen Frank, the Mandala Lady, and I'm here to pick three cards for Situation Saturday where um, the card one says the situation or gives insight about the uh, situation. Card two gives possible action and three is possible outcome. So, and today is August 17th, 2024. Uh, which deck am I using? This one, this one, this one, this one. So we're using the uh, wood wood deck. Let me take out the cards there. Okay, so we're setting the intention for us to receive insight and guidance regarding whatever situation we are seeking uh, insight on. And yeah, they're telling me I need to share what mine is. Okay, so my situation is I have these oracle decks that I basically printed a um, proof copy just to see what they would look like. And now I'm getting people wanting to be able to get them and I'm struggling with how to make that happen. And so I would, for me, I would like insight and guidance on what's uh, my next step or yeah, whatever insight you can give me. So for you, um, if you haven't already, pick a situation that you would like some insight on. I'll stop here. Okay. Top three cards. No, break the deck. Okay. And one, well, not break the deck, but split the deck. So the top three cards, situation, action, and outcome. Okay. Let me set these aside. Okay. All right. I know what I'm doing. All right. So situation is the portals card okay uh, actions oh interesting sacred space I like that one hey come back <laughs> sorry about that. and uh, third one is strength all right so what do those mean so the portals for the situation 19, 19, uh, look for openings. Oh, that's intriguing. Okay. And sacred space, possible action. Create a sacred space. Okay, I like where this is going. And uh, 23, strength. You will, we all have access to our divine inner strength. So if I, what well, kind of jumps out at me inside my head are the voices. Um, um, just, um, just get out of your head, <laughs> get out of your head, trying to figure it out because the brain trying to, you know, if, I'm, I'm assuming a situation that there's a, a problem, an obstacle, whatever. So it's something that's keeping us something that's occupying. Uh, and so we're trying to use our brain to solve the problem. The thing is, the brain has its place, the mind, brain, whatever you want to call it, but it, it can only work from what it already knows. Uh, all you know is all you know. So that's why we're being told to um, look for other openings beyond us, create a sacred space. And so when I, I like to connect with my team of guides and angels, so uh, they're, they're my sacred space. And through that, we gain the strength that we're, we're not alone. Um, we don't have to go it alone. It, I almost get the sense that the situation perpetuates itself because we're trying to figure it out and because we can't figure it out or we're not able to or we're still stuck in it, then we uh, procrastinate, we binge a chocolate bar or whatever you're food of choice, whatever your binge of choice is. So we're being asked to basically stop what you're doing the way you've been doing it and um, be open to other possibilities. So for me with the um, deck of cards, with the Oracle decks is um, I can either self-publish them in that I could um, put up a lot of money up front have them printed, try and sell them, 
I could try and find a publisher uh, to, which I'm told that's a long process. Publisher where they take care of everything in the third. And then yesterday I just, or Thursday, uh, anyway, earlier this week I got somebody had said, oh, Kickstarter, use Kickstarter. So right there, there's three options. And, but there's probably other options that I hadn't considered. So the um, best thing I can do is create sac sacred space. So for me, it's taking a sacred space is, um, I like to do what's called a, a coning session. If you go to paralandra-ltd, that's, I'll, I'll write it down in the description. Um, or and or Google or I'll Google it and I'll see if I can find it. But basically, the coning session ties into um, an earlier card pull I do. I, I can't remember if it's for the. I think it's for the month of August to use nature spirits. And basically, coning is all about connecting with nature spirits. Anyway, I do that that what like ceremony kind of thing. Whatever you use, it could be that you open a prayer, you set intention, anything that you are creating a sacred space so that you can tap into energies beyond your brain. And your brain will actually benefit because once it has this new idea that it, it said, oh, I see, uh, then the brain can latch onto it and then go figure out how to make that happen. And then through that, we uh, become stronger because we're able to move forward and it gets easier as new situations come up we we know this um, process okay i hope that helps i'm looking forward to um, playing with this and getting some more insight about hearing what my uh, team has to say about what to do with the oracle with this and give my brain a rest all right have have a great week take care till the next time bye bye